We're installing stickers 101. Here we go. <laughs> Class time, people. <laughs> we have uh, we found our center line of our main logo. This is what we want level. This is this is the catch-all for the company. And we centered it up on the door, side to side, top to bottom, got everything located. Now, if you notice, the sticker itself is on a backing paper. We're going to peel off this protector, and then we're going to lay it back, start from the top, squeegee it out each way until the sticker's down to the bottom. Top to bottom, side to side, you got to be real careful. No air bubbles, no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Has to go on right the first time. You have to be really careful peeling the backer off. These stickers are so sensitive. They've got really good adhesive. They will stick to anything they touch. So <laughs> be sure to have it located and be sure to have some tape holding it in place. Now you see right here on the backer, this is what you got to be careful of. You almost need an extra set of hands. Can I get an extra set of hands, guys? <laughs> you got to get me on camera. Yep. <laughs> These hands belong to Larry. Howdy guys, how's it going? He's normally a welder, today he's a sticker installer. Yeah. <laughs> We're having some issues right here where it's stuck to the backer. Get this to peel. All right, I'm gonna have to fold this one. If you can keep this one from sticking to anything. I got you. Homie. All right, you got that one, I'll get this one. Make sure all dust and dirt's out from underneath. Clean surface, wax free. Now, we'll come back against the tape and I'll start squeegeeing this dude on here. Like I said, top down, side to side, no air bubbles. You gotta keep everything coming down. Everything looking nice and straight. And that's what this whole protective paper is for. So you can do this. The truth is it gonna let go? Oh yeah. Moving on. Keep squeegee on it. Keep it tight. Be very, very careful. Very careful. Lots of little details in these stickers. Last thing you want to do is pull one up and tear it. Yeah, All right, guys, we got the sticker on. We got the air bubbles out. I think just about finished. Fat burger. We got one more side to go, buddy. Your car's looking good. Okay, I'm back from the old shop. We're at the new shop. This is the end of the fat burger project. Michelangelo, you got fat burger on there. It's looking good. Did you tell them all about it while I was over there? I sure did. We have our trucker here. Now, what's the name of your trucking company? Lead Sled, L-E-A-D-S-L-E-D. -E -E Lead Sled Classic Carriers. Lead Sled, you must be like an old guy. Lead yeah, I'm sled. getting older every day. Man. <laughs> <laughs> so are you a Kemp guy too? Custom Kemp guy? No, no. no just, just Lead Sled, just, huh? Just an old guy. What's well, done is fixing to go there. I think they're going to give it away at the end of uh, June is when the, the time they're going to give it away. The proceeds are going to go to uh, Wounded, Warriors. Wounded Warriors, and it's done. That's what makes it special to me, the Wounded Warrior. My brother come back from Iraq with his head trauma. Yeah, it hits home. <laughs> it's nice when anybody can help them soldiers out. Well, this is a Photoshop picture of the car. Richard came and said he wants this car, and uh, there was no car like that. We'd built one before. So I think it looks like it. It's the first time we've ever built a car, according to a picture. I shouldn't say that. We were part of the Big T project. The Big T was uh, a model that was built back in the 60s. We were part of recreating that car. But Michael, I think your flames look pretty close. 
Thank you. Unless they just uh, put the picture next to the car, you, you wouldn't know the difference. <laughs> so here's how you get your tickets. You can give Richard a call. Here's the phone number. And actually, if you're in San Clemente or out in that way, you purchase a ticket, you can get a get a hamburger too. So it's $20 for a ticket here, it looks like, and it's going to be given away the end of June. I believe it's going to be given away the end of June, so I'm not sure about that, but it's time to put this thing on the truck. Well, this is where the journey ends for us. It's going to be a, a sweet ride for somebody in California or wherever, uh, wherever it winds up, and then the journey will start all over again. Well, off to California with it.